You filed suits? Well, let me just tell you something that's not gonna be easy. No? No, just listen. They're gonna try to make it as something other than suicide, maybe murder, I don't know. Just stay put. And don't talk to the other guys at the office. Alright, I'll talk to you later. Bye. It was our fourth time meeting this week. I'd go to her little apartment, pick her up, we'd fight about whose car to go in, and I'd always win. It was a game I hoped would never end. And the moon comes up over the hills. Isn't that funny? Even when it's bright as day out? You bet. And if you drive a little further, you can see where the moon meets the sun. It's really crazy, I mean, like... No, I shouldn't. But why? Many reasons. It's just not nice. Not nice to who? Well... To who? You like me, don't you? Of course I do. I'm crazy about you. She said she was too, saying her last few weeks were the greatest she's ever had, but... But what I'm gonna say might hurt you. I knew it before I said it. You know. But it's not like that. I didn't see him. Okay then. But I did see him. Of course she did. But I didn't talk to him. I only... The only one. He didn't do it! This is a short story, but... She went on and on about how she saw him with Phyllis, how she followed them up to look out, and they talked about money, his degree, and... Are you listening? Oh, sorry, yeah. Go on. She put together that if Phyllis hired Nino to kill her dad, she'd have paid. But she did. You know what that means? But he didn't do it. He didn't know anything about it. But this was about more than Nino's clear name. I thought you gave up on the idea that anyone else was a part of this. No. Well, I did. But that's just because I didn't think anyone else would do it besides him. But I didn't give up. I knew he didn't do it. And when I found out, I knew there was only one thing that I had to do. Oh yeah? Get her back for it. How so? She's suing your company tomorrow, right? I'll just come and testify and- Now wait a minute. She had all the evidence for a real case against Phyllis. A silk thing, white powder, and red lipstick on her face, a dagger in her hand. And there's the black dress that she bought before my dad's trip. Could have been a black dress for a special dinner. But it wasn't. The lady at the store said those were morning clothes. Morning! She knew what she was doing. She knew. But it isn't enough. But it is. I'll get her in court, yell at her, force her to confess, and send her where she belongs. Jail, with all the other cold, heartless murderers. Lola, come back. No, you have to help me. I can't. I'm not in the case anymore. Tomorrow morning. Tell your company that I'm gonna testify. I'll bring anything you need. The dress, the lipstick, anything. Lola, your father fell off the train. We investigated, there's nothing we can do. This isn't about my father. This is about giving her what she deserves. Walter, I would fight for you if I had to. You know that. I know. Let's not waste this view. In the morning? In the morning. And in that moment, I knew what I had to do. Kill Phyllis.